Hi friends, welcome to 30 Inks 30 Days Day uh, 13. Um, I was sewing yesterday, this is also my sewing desk and boy did I have to do a lot of like, oh no, there's, there's pens and needles and thread everywhere. Kind of clean up. Um, you're in my light. Oh, I also didn't turn on my light. Well, okay, the lights are on. Can't promise anyone's home, though. Um, so yesterday we had pumpkin patch. I don't have the pin here. Let me tell you something not to do, though. Don't leave the blinds open and let the warm air come in with the sample laying on its side so that it leaks and gets all over your desk. Suggestion. Don't do that. Um... I did suck, I got the ink, some of the ink back, but with the syringe, like fortunately it was right here. Anyway, here is that dried splat. You can perhaps tell this ink has pretty nice shading. Is another watery ink, so fine on this Tamoa River, less fine on the Regalia paper. but. The past is behind us. We will move on having learned nothing. And <laughs> let's go into today. So this stack is getting smaller. Oh, that feels good. Let's cut it. And looking away, closing the eyes. This in here, it doesn't want to break up. So that's where we want to go. There's our card. I hope you can see it. And what? What? <sighs> okay, so today's ink will be Andorillium Flapjack Octopus Orange. You know, it's nice. It's been a while since I had an orange ink. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool. Yeah, I'm like so excited about this. Let's go. Let's go. Let's find a pen. together woman um let's just do here that's fine that's fine it's fine okay so hi how are you doing today Just, uh, I'm having a great morning. I hope you can say the same. Well, or that you did. Yeah, we knew that was going to work perfectly. Twisbees always fill so perfectly from these files. Yep, it's still working perfectly.
Can you see this? Yeah, you can see this. It's not actually intentional. Turn, turn. Thank you. Turn, turn. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, my scientist friend. Look, you're going to have to send a whole team over and then we'll peer review the findings. But obviously, something's wrong with nature in my... I'm going to pause this because, like, things are about to go really poorly. That's what I really firmly believe in my heart. Oh. Okay, things went okay. Things went okay. Maybe it's that it just somehow cannot form enough pressure to fill unless you start the plunger at the bottom. And since I like getting partial fills, when do I ever do that? Because what I discovered is if I have the plunger at the bottom, then when I do this, it totally dries out the feed. So then the pen doesn't write immediately. But maybe we then just dip it. Hmm. Interesting thoughts for such a perfect day. Um, we need that open. Right. Right. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Look what happened. The tip got discolored. I'm not sure how or why. Don't be like this. I see you in there. Don't put it in your tea. Step one. Don't put it in the tea. Is that a step? Yeah. In my life, that's a step at this point. It's at chug and temp. Okay, so this is um, some kind of ink. Anderillium flapjack octopus orange. Did I zoom in? No. Let's zoom in. is the Twisby Eco Clear 1.1 Stub. Let's go over here. Let's write our little thing on here to know we inked it. And write. And 30 inks, 30 days. Uh, April, oh, I see, 2023. Day 13. This was inevitable. It's the 13th. 
I see. Here's a question for you. Are you superstitious about the number 13? If I remember right, Manda really likes 13 as a number. I wouldn't, I, you know, I would say in the words of Dwight Schrute, I'm a little stitious. <laughs> Sorry. I read that the name of the fruit was Norange. So it wasn't an orange, it was a Norange. And somehow we set, we changed that over time. And that really makes sense because if you think of the word in Spanish, naranja, Anyway, have you also heard that? Also, if I pronounced that incorrectly, I did try. Um, you know, I apologize. A lesson learned, never try. This is just like orange. It really doesn't have anything else going on. They were like, we should have orange. Okay. Here we go. Orange. Move the tea out of the way of the, oh God, oh God, it's spilling. Stop, stop. It was mostly empty. <clears throat> now it's totally empty because that'll teach it. I wanted a very aggressive splat today. I think I've succeeded. I'll show this orange who's boss. I'll teach your grandmother to suck eggs. Oh, oh, almost broke this thing. Okay, sorry for the funkiness, everyone. It happens sometimes. This is dried enough. Oh, interesting. It's got some, uh, it's got a neat halo on this paper. Oh, you know what I thought was fun to look at? Look at this. The Moon River writing is just... All but illegible. Anyway, let's do this page. So we can see the two oranges next to one another. Where's my rag? For tea and ink. This I could, I filled in with the back of the pen because I was, the, 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 this was like, I had just cleaned it and I just thought, forget it. Forget it. I'm not dirtying it. Back of the nib. Which is why the writing is also such a mess as I then smeared it. Okay. There's that. This, this is looking beautiful. What do we, let's just say flapjack octopus. I don't bother writing the brand on here because like it's on an, an, uh, it's on the other page, you know, like it's here, not there. Here's our month so far.
It's a weird month, y'all. Yeah. Okay, so thanks for joining me for day 13 of 30 Inks, 30 Days. I hope you had fun. Um, <laughs> and I hope whenever you're watching this, as I like seem to always say, so I guess it's my thing now, but I hope that you're having a wonderful day and I will be back again tomorrow with day 14. Bye.